Hi, I am Lalit Vasist. Before starting this video, let me first tell you that we will discuss the possibility of life after death and the concept of consciousness purely on the basis of latest researches in the field of quantum physics, not on any spiritual basis. So watch this video till the end as it is based on science and going to be very interesting. According to University of Arizona's Stuart Hamroff and British physicist Sir Roser Penrose, consciousness is nothing but the information is stored at a quantum level. Sir Roger Penrose and his team have found evidence that this quantum information is carried by a structural component of human cells. These structural components are protein-based microtubules. This quantum information is stored at the subatomic level. When a person temporarily dies, this quantum information is released into the universe from the microtubules. If he or she revive from this unconsciousness or apparent death, the quantum information is channeled back into the microtubules. And this experience is what we call as near-death experience. But if the person is not revived and dies, it is possible that this quantum information can exist outside the body, perhaps indefinitely, as a soul, says Roger Penrose. This idea of Roger Penrose is also supported by the researchers from the renowned Max Planck Institute for Physics in Munich. It is also believed that the consciousness travels to parallel universes after death. So in this way, we are immortal. Only the body dies, but the spiritual quantum field continues. According to Robert Lenza, we are immortal and exist outside of time. His new scientific theory suggests that death is not the terminal event we think. There are an infinite number of universes and everything that could possibly happen occurs in some universe. Death does not exist in any real sense in these scenarios. All possible universes exist simultaneously regardless of what happens in any of them. Although individual bodies are destined to self-destruct, the alive feeling, who am I? is just 20 watt fountain of energy operating in the brain. But this energy doesn't go away at death. One of the surest axioms of science is that energy never dies. It can neither be created nor destroyed. But does this energy transcend from one world to the another? That's the question. Wave particle duality is a fundamental concept of quantum mechanics. According to this theory, elementary particles like photons and electrons have the property of both particles and waves. According to physicists, this wave particle duality theorem can possibly be extended to the soul body dichotomy. If for all the things, whether it is living or dead, there exists a quantum code, then there is an existence after death. Dr. Hans Peter former head of the Max Planck Institute for Physics in Munich posits that just as a particle writes all of its information on its wave function, the brain is the tangible floppy disk on which we save our data. And this data is then uploaded into the spiritual quantum field. So when we die, the body or the physical disk is gone, but our consciousness or the data on the computer lives on. So this was all about the theories and researches that are being conducted to know the reality of life after death. In the next videos, I will discuss more such interesting stuff regularly. So you can subscribe my channel Engineering Made Easy so that you don't miss any video. You can also support me just by liking this video and sharing it with others. Thank you so much for being with me till the end. See you soon with another such new information. Till then, bye bye, enjoy, take care.